my end makers, 3rd of April 2024, according to senior government sources, the Chinese debt trap concerns India, which is closely monitoring the new Nepalese government. The communist takeover of Nepal, which China financed, armed, and trained in opposition to an established democratic government, was a coerced takeover masquerading as a democracy founded on communism. According to authoritative government sources, the Indian government is reportedly closely monitoring the new regime in Nepal and is prepared to offer its entire support. Nevertheless, they demand a reciprocal commitment to the relationship. Pushpa Kamala Dahal Prakanda, the Prime Minister of Nepal, reorganized the cabinet last month after terminating an almost 15-month alliance with the Nepali Congress because of substantial discord among the party's highest-ranking officials. Conversely, he assembled a novel coalition predominantly consisting of left-leaning political parties, including the party affiliated with the late Prime Minister K.P. Sharma Oli. An official from the Indian government emphasized that the allegation that India supports corrupt politics in Nepal is entirely unfounded. India is dedicated to expeditiously restoring confidence in Nepal. India is exceptionally apprehensive regarding the increasing integration among South Asian nations and the heightened involvement of China, the United States, and Europe, as stated by officials. Officials noted that while economic and geopolitical competition in South Asia has been limited thus far, the growing interest of the United States and China has prompted some parties to actively work towards establishing an unfavorable environment for India in the region. Officials assert that India is committed to fostering holistic progress in Nepal by providing financial aid, establishing credit lines, and facilitating development collaboration. Officials predict that despite China's recent infrastructure setbacks in Nepal, Prime Minister Oli will maintain closer ties with Beijing for various reasons. Reliable sources suggest that China will pressure Nepal to support the Belt and Road Initiative BRI, now that it is in power. Recent intelligence reports also indicate that Nepal and China will likely finalize the BRI implementation plan shortly. Officials underscored that India firmly opposes Nepal's participation in any such agreement and has thus far managed to deter Nepal from doing so with relative success. According to official statements, Nepal commenced work on 35 projects after signing the Framework Agreement for the Belt and Road Initiative BRI, in 2017. Nevertheless, due to India's ongoing obstructionism towards Nepal, the number of initiatives was curtailed to nine. According to officials, India is primarily concerned that Nepal will fall victim to a Chinese debt scheme, similar to the situation that occurred in Sri Lanka. Sources also report that officials recommended that Nepal apply to China for soft, concessional loans and grants rather than commercial loans, which may trap the country in a debt quagmire. Officials underscored the critical nature of India's diligent endeavors to counter China's substantial influence in Nepalese society. China maintains a significant number of FM stations in Nepal and employs cyber syndicates to target India, attempting to woo Nepalese citizens to China. An official affirmed that India was devoting significant effort to fostering stability in the region and commended Prime Minister Oli's favorable disposition towards India, emphasizing the two nations' enduring familial and cultural ties, 